should start a new British detective programme called Perm and Mullet. I think this sounds like a couple of detectives who roam around the countryside <laughs> solving rural crime. I found all this. What, this? Are you so soon? Yeah, this farm here. So have you missed a bit on this farm as well? I think I vaguely remember that, actually. <laughs> As darkness fell, we arrived at the Farming Oscars. Oh, there you go. Drop me off over there. Where? Just by the red carpet. I'm not dropping you by the red carpet. Why? I'm not dropping no, you. Just over there. I am not your chauffeur. It's my award. It's not your award. It is. Please, just, just, just there. Oh, for God's sake. Thank you. All right? Thank you. I, you owe me one for this. Go and park the car. How are you doing? Make sure it's close. Shut up. Oh, I'm going to have to go round the block. Jesus. How are you doing? Inside, Caleb's red carpet moment continued. We just want to <laughs> say That's all we you want. You deserve a medal. <laughs> what did you just do? I told you. Go for it. Yeah, the only difference between genetically modifying is that you can insert DNA from different organisms, but with gene editing, you're editing the organism itself. See my little cufflinks? Oh, they're oh, wicked! They're so cute! Where's from? Once the rural Brad Pitt had finished doing the rounds... Good evening, ladies and gentlemen! We sat down for the awards, which were being hosted by none other than Vernon Kay. Ladies and gentlemen, you are the great, the good, the awesome of the British farming industry. How right he was. James Drummond, A and W, James Drummond! Over the next hour, I saw awards given out to unsung heroes. Thank you very much. People who work day and night at the mercy of weather world politics and Whitehall nonsense just to put food on all our tables. So I felt quite humble when this happened. The Flying the Flag for British Agriculture Award. Caleb Cooper, Jeremy Clarkson! Obviously, I'm a fraud here. Of course I am. I'm not a farmer. I'm a trainee farmer at best. Two years. Stop nodding. I couldn't have done it without him. Ladies and gentlemen, Caleb Cooper! <laughs> I've won an award! <laughs> if this had been the Oscars, everyone would have headed off at this point to the Vanity Fair after party. Here, though, it was time for the annual cider drinking contest. We have a winner. Well done. 